only cardio I have done is long walks on the beach in Australia. <laughs> Love makes you fat and out of shape. <laughs> I'm vlogging. This video is brought to you by... Just kidding, we're not jumping into that yet. I'm not gonna do you guys like that. First day back in the vlog and I'm already dropping brands. I will be dropping brands though in the future, just to let you guys know. YouTube's an expensive hobby to have. Today, we're gonna go do a little track workout. You gonna do a track workout, Dana? I'll film it. Yeah, are you gonna do a track workout, Morgan? I'll film it too. <laughs> Instagram um, stories. There's literally one camera. I got Instagram stories. You're gonna film it for Instagram stories? Yeah. And what are you gonna do, bro? Mitch, man in the van? I don't run, man. You don't run? I don't run. I run to the cupboard. Well, I'm gonna be running. Jake and Brennan, you guys have met Jake before. I don't know if you guys have actually met Brennan before. He's downstairs, we're gonna go run. Jake wants to get back to running a five minute mile. If Jake at 240 pounds can run a five minute mile, I will pay him $500. He's gotta do it though before one month from this video. So you guys mark it on your calendars. $500, five minute mile. I think that's gonna be intense. I wanna get my mile down to six minutes. I'm gonna do redo that military challenge because I only did seven laps instead of eight we found out. So I'm gonna be redoing that and I wanna run six minute miles. $500. For what? If you do a five minute mile within 30 days from this video. 30 days, no chance. No? No. What's your mile time right now? Awful. Okay, well, how much do you weigh? 236, 237 today. And do you think you do sub seven minutes? Okay, then that's not awful. Oh, my name is Jake. I'm 237 pounds. I run a 6.45 minute mile. That's not awful, bro. When you used to run close to five, it's pretty good. Yeah, that's true, I guess. All right, so today we're gonna go to the track. We're gonna be running some 400s. Just the whole goal of this is not dying. It's cold outside, lungs might freeze. It's gonna be an interesting thing. And I'm looking at my office right now. And uh, look at these posters that are still on the ground. We're gonna actually leave before those posters ever get up. Trying to find a spot to build our own gym and maybe have some retail space. So more on that to come. But right now we're gonna go exercise. When was the last time you were on my YouTube channel? Me? Yeah. Probably when everybody was making fun of my calves. Oh, I remember that. <laughs> we did a video and there were comments Yo, about so dirty. calves. Let's see your calves, man. Are they really that bad? I don't know. What do you think? No. I would say those are better than average calves. That's Thanks, they're athletic calves. They're Thank athletic you. Calves. You know, you know what? Brennan would be a hell of an AFL player. I you, feel like. Yeah. What's AFL? The best uh, sport Aussie, in the world. Aussie football. Yeah, Australian Football League. I would say you have an AFL body type. Like, Let's get over to Australia. Why not? Well, let's do it. One I'm day, show, I'm I will end up there. We will end up there. Well, of course you're gonna end up there. Yeah. How about you, Tyson? You wanna end up there? Me and Kayla actually wanna go on a trip here this summer. Kayla is Tyson's better half. Wait. Yeah. So we the might American actually- The American summer or the Australian summer? Um, It'd be the American summer, so Australian. Winter. Yeah, we, we, we wouldn't necessarily Which isn't really winter yeah. anyway. But it's still nice there, right? Yeah, it's like 90. In the winter? Up, up near me. Up no, near me, no, guys. not in the winter. Yeah, during the day. You mean up by where you live? Yeah, up where I live. In Cannes? In the middle of the day, it's still around. Shoot. <laughs> I dropped that. <laughs> All right, so these are the faces you see when you walk into fitness culture. Welcome where's, to fitness culture. Where's Hayden at? How may we help you? <laughs> he's, in, he's in the lift right now, I think. Hayden's lifting? Yeah, yeah. That guy's, that guy's class, man. I like that guy. He crushes it. You should have seen his boots yesterday. He had spurs and uh, <laughs> yeah. chains on. Yeah, the first time I met Hayden was with his brothers and they came to an expo. Really? And they were all like dicked out. So Hayden, if you still watch my videos, I know you work at the front desk, so maybe you don't care to like watch my videos because you see enough of me. If you do watch this video, shout out to you, man. Good job. All right, man, let's go run. You, let's you go. know what we're doing Are today? Are you ready to run? We're gonna run some 400s, man. Yeah, but we're easing into it. I'm definitely not ready for this. We're really easing into it, these, these first uh, few weeks. You know what? If you're an athlete, though, you run 400s. It's true. Like, if you're a real athlete, you run 300 meter hurdles. Did that once in my life, never do it again. If you ran track in my high school, at some point during the season, they forced you to run the 300 hurdles. The worst thing ever. <laughs> I was like, killing it, first 100, and then I just die. Like, I like come across the finish line just like walking basically. I remember one time, I was probably started off in lane like seven. The guy right to my inside lane, he passed me and he was smoking me. Ooh. And like mid run, we were coming up on the first curve. Mid run, he passed me. I'm like, oh man, you're fast at these. <laughs> Next hurdle, boom! <laughs> he goes down? He eats shit. I was like, oh, never mind. <laughs> This is all monologue mid run. It was great. <laughs> <laughs> it's one of my favorite memories from I love that. Uh, and that was in Texas? Yeah. yeah. You guys had some athletes in Texas. Oh, I got smoked. There's some athletes in Texas for sure. <laughs> Back to the old stomping grounds. Good old Dixie State. Home of the Trailblazers. When I was here, we were the Red Storm. They went Rebels, 
Red Storm, now they're the Trailblazers. What was not a mascot that really stuck on? Like, I, how do you dress up as a Red Storm? Like, like a Red Tornado? Yeah, Red Tornado. It's kind of bright out here, so I'm gonna put on my movement sunglasses. The link may or may not be in the description. You guys can use my cook code. That's also in the description. Get 15% off when you need some sunglasses. Struggle's real. <laughs> oh, we got 400s today. We're gonna be doing four 400s, minute rest, running about 80 seconds for 400s. So we're just easing into this. It's probably gonna be hard for me right now. 80 seconds is. Yeah, 80 seconds seconds is <laughs> it, it isn't. It should be if it you're in shape. Be. But it's not gonna be for us. Well, for me, I'm man. definitely not in shape, so I'm gonna probably say 90 seconds for me. That's a minute and a half. If you guys are under 200 pounds or in decent shape, try to do these in under 80. Decent and you know what I'm gonna probably do? Because it's gonna take me longer to recover. I'm gonna probably have to walk one. Run one, walk one. <sighs> one minute rest, okay, that's gonna be tough. Here we go. I'm getting a head start. Hold on. Three more. I'm gonna die. What's the time? 30 seconds. Wait, don't go. Come on, man. I get, I get past. You skin yourself less rest. Making it harder on Yeah. I'm done. So out of shape. What time are you guys going? Okay. <laughs> <laughs> Got beat up on that one. <sighs> oh, the side ache is real. The side ache is real. Run through the money, the press will be calling. Left on my blessings, I feel like I'm falling. The birdie is back. Tell me I'm garbage, I'm going through something, that's why I ain't calling. Phone and progression, it's all that I wanted. The phone and affection, I summon and dub it, cause I ain't calling. Phone and progression, it's all that I wanted. The phone and affection, I summon and dub it. How's that, man? Rough. Nice. First step to admitting you have a problem is accepting it. Saying it out loud. But problem, I'm not in shape. Let's get in shape. Let's do some cardio. The minute rest felt so long back in the day. Not today. This is day one. Day one of, uh, of figuring out what I've been doing isn't working. The only cardio idea I've done is long walks on the beach in Australia. <laughs> Love makes you fat and out of shape. <laughs> now it's time for uh, the, bro, the bro stretch session time. We just sit around, we talk about who's the greatest athlete of all time. Pretty much wanted to show people the athletic prowess of Wilt Chamberlain, saying he was the greatest of all time. Now, I'm a Bo Jackson fan till I die. Bo's my favorite, but I think there's something special about a seven foot one dude high jumping seven foot and running a four six forty. Smokes crack all night and then like wakes up the next morning and gets three sacks. Lawrence Taylor? Yeah. Hey, Lawrence, Lawrence Taylor's up there. Lawrence Taylor is a hell of an athlete, but he, he was he was born to tackle quarterbacks, like long arms. I mean, in that same regard, Bruce Smith was an animal too, and he did lift some weights. That's what I'm saying. He's all-time sacked. LT just showed up. He did. You know what though? That was Bo Jackson too. Bo Jackson didn't touch away. They made a good point. Like if Bo Jackson had been born like five years later, we wouldn't have thought it was that impressive because steroids were then a thing. But like when Bo was there, steroids really weren't a thing. Like. No one ever thought Bo was on steroids. They still had steroids when he was playing, right? They did. But probably, like, they didn't lot. have like Balco and stuff, like uh, wide, wide. I think they just had people actually using them. Like, no one cared. <laughs> yeah, like Brian Bosworth. Yeah, but Bo didn't. Bo didn't, no. Bo looked the same year round. This lovely track day continues with some stairs. You guys want to run these where uh, since I'm the slowest, I'll take off, and then the second person tries to catch me, and then the last person tries to catch the second person? Sounds like so, running that hard. so much fun. After those 400s we just crushed. Day one, man. We got a long way to go. Oh, you're saying don't blow my load right off the bat? Exactly. Okay.
I've said it a million times. Well, maybe in a million. At least a thousand. It's easier to stay in shape than to get in shape. That being said, I don't know why I ever let myself get out of shape, but it's definitely apparent. So this workout today, I treat it just like I would a leg session in the gym. Quads, glutes, hamstrings, stair work, even 400s. You know, we're not running long enough really to go too oxidative, maybe in that 400. This stair work, you know, it's 10 to 15 seconds long. It's anaerobic, which means we're using ATP. It's like the exact same as ripping out 15 reps on a back squat. The legs are burning, it hurts, it's gonna build muscle, so this is why we do days like this. We're obviously getting a better endurance, but we're also getting more explosive and faster. You know, it's not enough just to walk on the treadmill at an incline even. You know, that's gonna be good for endurance. That's gonna keep you in shape. If, if it's between that and doing nothing, definitely do that. But try to work in some of these hit routines. Good for your heart, good for your musculature system. You're gonna have better overall muscle, endurance, and strength during these workouts. So make sure you guys give this a like. And if you're not subscribed, my channel is all about fitness, some lifestyle. We also have fitness culture where we do our programming. We got about six different programs in there, ranging from bodybuilding to more athletic stuff like this. So check that out as well. That one's just purely all fitness stuff. So thank you guys for watching. Till next time.